Ah, oh, Mexico. My brothers from another mother, the Mexicans. That, that's all I have to say. I have never actually visited Mexico, actually. But I've had a lot of video conferences uh, with my client there. Um, very, it, actually one of my larger clients down in, uh, in Mexico. And, um, and isn't it amazing with technology these days? Well, actually, I think it was, uh, it was sort of catapulted or uh, COVID was the catalyst for this online meeting story. But I first uh, interacted with them during COVID, so it all, everything had to be online anyway. So I've had lots of video conferences with them. And I remember the initial, the initial conferences when we all, you know, the first meeting, we all switched our cameras on and greeted and started introducing ourselves. And I was, I took a good look at all the people on my screen, you know, and, and they were looking equally intently at me because we look so much alike. It was unbelievable. It's like amazing how you could be on two opposite ends of the world. You have different cultures. You're completely different. But just to look at the guys and their hairstyles and their skin colorings and their facial structures, not too far off from They could have been my brothers, actually. And uh, I kept thinking that all the way through talking to them. I had this huge uh, smile on my face. Well, so did they also had the same thing. And uh, one of them even said, look, if, if only you could speak Spanish, we would have thought you from down the road here, Mexico. So uh, it was amusing to me, very amusing. And I, I felt that connection and they did as well. And I think it was good for my business, to be honest, because uh, there was that immediate connection and trust and everyone just relaxed. What an icebreaker. You know, they thought they were talking to this, I don't know, this Indian gentleman from India which I'm not, I'm South African Indian, but they were, I think they were expecting something completely different to what they got. Um, but anyway, it's amazing. It's, it, to me, it's just amazing how that similarity is always there. But I find that often, actually, many other countries I go to, and I think it's because of my mixed, uh, uh, my mixed genes, Indian and Cape Malay. I mean, if you mix those two together, there's a lot of places you can go in the world and blend in. So, um, so it's not something new, but it, it's always great to see people, you know, the foreigners that, and, and you find an immediate connection. Um, so I'm still waiting for an opportunity to visit Mexico and, and, and sample the food, you know. They eat a lot of chili. I like hot foods. Um, I can't wait to have the tacos, the soft tacos and the hard tacos. And, and of course, I can't wait to sample some of their tequila. And, and that was another thing. I researched a lot of jokes about Mexico and a lot of jokes about tequila. And you know, my meetings are always very professional, but I was dying to tell them at least one of my tequila jokes. And you know, maybe one day when, when I do get to visit there, I can imagine myself lying under a huge cactus with a big sombrero, drinking some tequila and just sharing all of these jokes that I'd spent so much of time and effort to research. So Mexico, I'm coming to visit you one day. If you would like us to do more posts and something specific you would like to know about, please comment your suggestions below.